was it true that you were trying to be a radio announcer at one yeah. point with a little very, cassette player? Very true, yeah. <laughs> we didn't have any radio or TV where we grew up at first, so um, I should say there's TV, but we didn't personally own one. So we kind of didn't have much entertainment at all unless you made it up yourself. So I'd use this little cassette recorder and do the news, the weather, the sports. Can I hear just like a, a little? Well, it's a high of 72 degrees, but it's going to be 78 degrees inside the Danforth Music Hall where High Valley is heating things up right now. Back to you, Peter Mansbridge. <laughs> um, that's it. That's all that's I great. got. That's all I got. <laughs> that was great. Um, you had the cassette player. Yeah, and we'd record songs. The band was always called High Valley, so people ask when High Valley was created. Many, many, many moons ago. I mean, I was probably not even 10 years old when that band got created. So yeah. High Valley's existed longer than we have, pretty much. Longer than I have, for sure. And for the listeners that don't know how High Valley got its name, what is the name about? We have a theory, and that is our cousin's band was called the Dry River Boys. So we thought the whole oxymoron thing was the way to go so Fun. that's our theory <laughs>